ever wished for a smarter chat experience, right? Today, OpenAI's big news is all about that. They've introduced a new feature for ChatGPT that makes your conversations more personalized. Imagine having a chat assistant that remembers your conversations. But wait, there's more? Curious, let's dive in. Google, Apple, and other tech behemoths were caught off guard when OpenAI ignited the generative artificial intelligence revolution in late 2022. In 2024, the Microsoft-backed business is still in the lead in the competition to provide the best. With the most recent update to the Gemini large language model, Google is getting close to matching ChatGPT. Now, OpenAI is talking about another big leap with a new memory feature. So, what exactly is this feature? Well, OpenAI is testing ChatGPT's ability to remember the things you discuss. This means that if you mention something in a chat, like your preferences or important details about yourself, ChatGPT will remember them for future conversations. This feature is currently being rolled out to a small group of users, but it's expected to be available to everyone soon. The ChatGPT's memory control enables the chatbot to retain or lose important instructions and information shared by the user. This would probably assist the users in personalizing the conversation and removing the need for information repetition. The best part is that you're in control of ChatGPT's memory. You can choose to turn it on or off, and you can even tell it to forget specific things if you want. For example, if you tell ChatGPT that you prefer meeting notes with headlines and bullet points, it will remember that format for future meeting summaries accordingly. Or if you mention that you own a coffee shop and your toddler loves jellyfish, ChatGPT will use that information to help you brainstorm social media posts or birthday cards. But don't worry, your privacy is protected. OpenAI ensures that your data is not used to train future models without your consent. Plus, they've introduced temporary chats, similar to incognito mode in web browsers, where your conversations won't be remembered at all. If you're one of the lucky users who have access to this feature, you can find it in the settings under the Personalization tab. It's crucial to understand that deleting a conversation won't erase the memory connected to it. OpenAI states that they might use memory to enhance GPT training, but ChatGPT team and enterprise customers are automatically excluded and regular users are free to opt out. From there, you can view and delete specific memories, giving you full control over your conversations. Although, still in its experimental phase, the new feature has begun to roll out for a selected group of users from both the free and plus tiers. It is a groundbreaking feature that promises to revolutionize the way we interact with our digital assistants. Imagine a world where memories are not static recollections, but rather fluid, ever-changing entities that adapt to our needs and preferences in real time. This is the future that OpenAI envisions with its latest innovation. The concept is simple yet profound. Memories within AI systems, such as the renowned ChatGPT, are no longer static repositories of information, but dynamic and adaptable constructs that respond to user input and evolve over time. Gone are the days of rigid algorithms and fixed responses. With this new feature, users have the power to shape their interactions with ChatGPT on the fly, tweaking settings and preferences in real time to create a seamless and personalized experience. Whether it's adjusting writing tones for blog posts or customizing code preferences for software development tasks, the possibilities are endless. One of the most exciting aspects of this innovation is its potential to revolutionize business operations. Imagine being able to securely upload your monthly business data to ChatGPT and having it automatically generate tailored charts and reports with key takeaways. This level of automation not only saves time and resources, but also streamlines decision-making processes, empowering businesses to make data-driven decisions with ease. But what about privacy and security concerns? They said that memory brings additional privacy and safety considerations, such as what type of information should be remembered and how it's used. They're taking steps to assess and mitigate biases and steer ChatGPT away from proactively remembering sensitive information, like your health details unless you explicitly ask it to. It will be interesting to see how ChatGPT chooses what it's going to remember and what it chooses to forget. They've said that one of the things they don't want to do is remember sensitive information like your health details. One thing I want to urge you guys not to do is don't enter sensitive information into ChatGPT because they've repeatedly stated that this is a system they are training on to improve the model. People from time to time will be looking at certain conversations. So, don't put sensitive information in there because there is always the risk that a human reviewer, someone reviewing the certain conversations, could potentially see it. 
That was something we did see with Gemini because, of course, with AI competition and the AI race, what people do want to do is improve the models and they can do that by looking at the conversation. So, don't input anything like your bank details or anything absolutely crazy like that or anything that you wouldn't want ChatGPT to remember. This commitment to privacy and security ensures that users can trust ChatGPT with their most sensitive information without fears of compromise. Another groundbreaking aspect of this innovation is the introduction of memory-enabled custom GPTs. Builders now have the option to enable memory for their custom GPTs, allowing them to create unique and personalized experiences for their users. These memories are not shared between GPTs, ensuring that each custom GPT retains its distinct identity and adapts to the needs of its users independently. For team users and enterprise users, memory can be useful when using ChatGPT for work. It can learn your style preferences and build upon past interactions. This saves you time and leads to more relevant and insightful responses. For example, ChatGPT can remember your tone of voice, format risk preferences, and automatically apply them to blog posts without needing repetition. The GPTs will also have memories. GPTs will have their own distinct memory, and builders will have the option to enable memories for their GPTs. Memories are not shared with builders. To interact with a memory-based GPT, you will also need to have memory on. For example, the book GPT helps you find your next read. With the memory enabled, it remembers your preferences, such as your favorite genre and top books, and tailor accommodations accordingly without needing repeated inputs. What's also cool is that each GPT does have its own memory, so you might need to repeat details you previously shared with ChatGPT versus a GPT. If you're using the Artful Greeting Card GPT to create a birthday card for your daughter, it won't know her age or that she loves jellyfish. You'll need to tell it the relevant details. Overall, the introduction of memory in GPT-4 is a step in the right direction, making conversations more personalized and efficient. Users can expect more updates and improvements in the future as AI technology continues to evolve. In a world where data privacy and security are paramount, OpenAI's commitment to transparency and user control sets a new standard for AI technology. By empowering users to shape their digital interactions in real time, OpenAI is paving the way for a future where technology truly works for us, adapting to our needs and preferences with unprecedented flexibility and ease. So, whether you're a business owner looking to streamline operations or an individual seeking a more personalized digital experience, the future looks brighter than ever with OpenAI's memory-enabled ChatGPT at your fingertips. Drop your opinions about the new features in the comment box. If you enjoyed learning about OpenAI's memory and new ChatGPT control, please like, share and subscribe to our video. We want to keep bringing you more AI content like this. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.